Welcome to our FB page na Free Reviewers Managed by Leonalyn. At ang video ito, i-upload din natin sa ating YouTube channel na Solving Math with Leonalyn. Now, let's start from basic. Dito muna tayo sa multiplication of decimal numbers. And by the way, random post lang ito. Pero hindi natin i-reveal kung saan or kung sinong nag-post nito. Bago ang lahat, ito naman yung mga FB groups na lagi nating tinatambayan. Unahin natin yung pinakamadali. Doon muna tayo sa number 1. So, this is 0.7 times 3. Ang pinakasimpleng gawin lang natin, ay ito lang muna ang i-multiply natin 7 times 3 and that is 21. Now, doon naman tayo sa decimal number. Isa lang yan siya. So, therefore, from here na decimal, ito ba? I-move natin going to the left side. So, bali ang sagot dito ay 2.1. Now, para mas lalong maintindihan dito banda, so, more example, what if 0 0.07 times 3 or 0 0.007 times 3, isa pa? 0 0.0007 times 3. Ito lang ang i-multiply natin. 7 times 3, and that is 21. Tapos yung decimal, 1, 2. So, therefore, yung 21 natin yung decimal dito, kasi nasa pinaka-rightmost. I-move natin twice, 1, 2. So, ito na yung sagot, which is 0.21. Next, 7 times 3, 21. So, ilan yung decimal? 1, 2, 3. So, again, yung decimal dito sa 21 na sa right, i-move natin going to the left 3 times. 1, 2, 3. Nandyan na yung decimal at yung space lagyan natin ng 0. So, therefore, ang sagot dito ay 0 0.021. Next, 21 ulit yan siya. So, sulat natin yung 21. Ang decimal, 1, 2, 3, 4. So, mag-move tayo 4 times go, going to the left side. 1, 2, 3, 4. Yung decimal nandyan at yung space, yung dalawang space, lagyan natin ng 0. So, therefore, this is 0 0.0021. So, anyway, ang sagot dito sa number 1 ay 2.1. Next, dito naman tayo sa pinakamadali. Unahin natin yung pinakamadali. So, we have 300.47 times 10. Since 10 lang naman yan siya, itong decimal na to, i-move natin going to the right side once. So, therefore, ang sagot dito ay 3004 point seven another example three hundred point forty seven times one hundred dalawang zero yan siya so i move natin itong decimal na to going to the right side twice so therefore this is three zero zero four seven tapos yung decimal ay nandyan na siya so anyway ang sagot dito sa number four ay 3,004.7 Next, dito tayo sa number 2. Balikan natin si number 2. So, 1.26 times 24. Mag-multiply lang tayo. 6 times 4, this is 24. Carry 2. 2 times 4, that is 8. 8 plus 2, 10. So, ito yung 0, carry 1. 1 times 4, 4 plus 1, and this is 5. Next, 6 times 2, and that is 12. So, dito natin i-align sa 2. 12, so 2, carry 1. Dito natin i-carry. 2 times 2, and that is 4 plus 1, 5. Next, 1 times 2, and that is Two. So, i-add lang natin yan. 4, 2, 10, carry 1, 3. Now, remember, itong 1.26. 
yung decimal na yan. 1, 2. So, therefore, balik tayo dito sa sagot natin. Yung decimal, i-move natin twice going to the left side. 1, 2. So, ang sagot dito ay 30.24. So, this is 30.24. Next. Dito sa number 3, this is 10.13 times 46. Again, simpleng multiplication lang. 3 times 6, this is 18. So, 8, carry 1. 1 times 6, and that is 6, plus 1, 7. 0 times 6, and this is 0. 1 times 6, 6. Next. 3 times 4, and that is 12. Carry 1. 4 times 1, and that is 4, plus 1, 5. 0 times 4 is 0. So, this is 0, 1 times 4, and this is 4. So, i-add natin yan. This is 8, 9, 5, 6, 4. Now, remember yung decimal dito. This is 10.13. So, yung decimal, 1, 2. So, twice tayo nag-move going to the right side. So, yung answer natin, yung answer natin nandito yung decimal, i-move natin going to the left side. 1, 2. So, therefore, ang sagot dito ay 465.98. So, isulat natin 465.98. Now, kung meron kayo na intindihan sa video ito, kayo na ang sumagot dito sa number 5. This is 19.5 times 2. I-comment nyo ang tamang sagot dito. Thank you and God bless.